a chieftain of the All Progressive Congress, APC, Sally Ulukman, has urged a former governor of Edo State, Adam Sushumole, to stop blaming SY President Muhammad Buhari for the economic crisis plaguing the country. Ushumole, during an appearance on Chinese television, had claimed that Nigerians are suffering due to the long term consequences of the former president's reckless policy. So I don't understand. Ushumole just woke up all of a sudden to have realized the reckless policies of uh, Buhari. Hmm. However, reacting to Ushumole's claim via a statement issued in Abuja titled APC and Question of Liability. Open letter to APC leaders, Lukman stated that it would be uncharitable to make excuses for Tinumbu. I said, I told somebody that uh, this Lukman is the ambassador of a, of a, of PDP, okay, of a, a, a Basanjo of APC, because this guy can write. <laughs> I don't even know whether the guy, or whichever way, but at least he's speaking the truth. He has been on the neck of a APC. It's like he's the opposition in APC as well. So, and that is the truth. He said all of them are involved. That she stop pointing fingers. All of them kept quiet. The same way Oshomole knows and the people who are making excuses and defending Tinobu, they know that what is happening on that Tinobu is so is, is terrible. They won't say anything. But by the time he's no more in the office, they will begin to speak. He recalled protesting some of the policies which he claimed were de designed to dehumanize a population that was already in pain. The APC chieftain insisted that uh, all those in the leadership of APC, including the incumbent president, should be blamed for Buhari's policies. He said, sadly, instead of ruling with humility and reviewing policies when there is public outcry, they are grandstanding and giving excuses. They engage in the familiar blame games, attributing the consequences of government policies to the administration of former president buhari this is very uncharitable and dishonest with due respect to our leaders certainly the government of buhari did not measure up to the expectations of party members and nigerians in general but we must take responsibility the truth is that the success or failure of buhari's government represents the collective success and or failure of APC as a party. All of us in the leadership of the APC, including Tinubu, were complicit in one way or the other to all the circumstances that contributed to the failure of Buhari. Unfortunately, as things are, we are also strengthening the hands of Ashiwaju to continue the path of failure, just like we deluded Buhari into believing that every decision he took was right. Our leaders are today misleading Tinubu to de believe that all his decisions are right. Our leaders, including Comrade Oshomole, want us to believe that the past administration created the problem. If that is the case, why were they unable as party leaders to regulate the conduct of former President Buhari and prevent him from failing? Now that President Ashwaji Tinubu is in charge, what is being done to address this challenge and ensure that he does not even suffer the fate of his predecessor. My question is that when they say, oh, some people are just uh, uh, deceiving the president, that means anybody who can be deceived should not even have a business with a uh, leadership. Are they, are, they, are they children? These are the same people that they will tell you that uh, they have been in government, they, have, they, are, they are experienced, and you come and tell us that uh, some people are deceiving them. I don't understand. Nobody deceives anybody. Anybody that hurts the way you hurt, in as much you are not a child, you are a wicked person because you know exactly what you are doing. If they want to cover up, that is why they will not be telling you that, say, oh, some people are being deceived. How are we responsible for Buhari failure? Somebody is asking. You say all of them, not you. Sally, I eventually disagree with you that all APC are to blame because it's only the former president was shadowed with responsibility to control the affairs of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. But uh, Tinumbu and Yoshimole, then they were saying everything was okay now. So because, why did they not talk? But they said everything was fine. Adam Yoshimole is a bloody liar. He thought we have forgotten the role he played to bring Buhari to power and also save as, and serve as APC chairman, national chairman. Did Buhari for a field? Her cost of living is not high during his time. Which one be the past government and which be the present government? Is it not the same 
people don't worry Tinubu is still sleeping he needs much rest he will only wake up when there's a revolution he only wants his name in guinness book of record as a president of the federal republic of nigeria after planning for it for 30 years it is better to keep quiet and watch Tinubu drama adam sushomole has become a failure of all sorts he's completely confused by his statements to nigerians you as apc member you are not ashamed condemning your party on national delays really you should not be ashamed at, at least a day we a, you know posterity will judge him uh -huh. he's saying the truth now everybody is clearly quiet but at least he's the only person from the party i'm sure very soon they will say oh maybe because he has not been given appointment that is why he's not happy that is the usual way uh for a typical person like a, a, a typical nigerian person talks you are suffering somebody is still calling them as you are still saying so you love what Ushumole said that a, it was buhari that caused us this problem then why didn't he talk truth is bitter but he spoke the truth buhari's regime is the worst nigeria has ever seen Ushumole carrying your iniquities on your own head alone dirty sue talking of talking all of us Big shame, which is a wizard government, certain, uh, crazy, uh, so blame everyone except themselves. Uh, this man has said the old truth. Ushumole has no truth. All APC members are, mm, the name of good luck Jonathan has finally left them. Kai, exactly the truth. After the regime of Jonathan, APC keep blaming Jonathan and allow Buhari to believe his right thing so far. Jonathan had spoiled many things. Now, they are blaming Buhari so as to make Tinubu think anything he does is right. Our people in Nigeria fall with all the caricature politicians. So guys, uh, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this.